The cargo unmanned aircraft system is capable of satisfying the U.S. Marine Corps and Joint Services needs for logistic support to dispersed locations. This video illustrates an operational concept for the 3,000 pound payload weight mono tilt rotor design and introduces a notional TAK class cargo ship. This Panamax class commercial container ship is loaded with flat racks holding Joint Modular Intermodal Containers or JMIX. The ship has been lightly modified to provide selective offload of the JMIC. Three-ton gantry cranes are installed at each lashing bridge and in one move any of over 100 JMIX may be selected and placed on a monorail conveyor. The JMIX contents can be secured with padlock doors and identified with an active scanner for full inventory visibility and control. The JMIC is lifted to the flight deck and joined to an awaiting cargo pod. A traversal system moves both the cargo pod and the aircraft forward where they are joined together for vertical takeoff. During takeoff, the cargo pod is lifted nose up and the aircraft's wings are drooped with flaps deployed. This configuration reduces interference with the lifting rotor. After liftoff, the cargo pod envelops the JMIX for streamlined flight. The cargo pod's elevator and attach points are trimmed for efficient cruise. Conversion to an airplane mode occurs at 80 to 120 knots. Best high-speed cruise is achieved at 20,000 feet. While this particular design is optimized for a range of 750 nautical miles at 200 knots, an iteration of this design could target a different altitude and airspeed. Delivery is achieved by one of two methods. The first is that a container is fully released from the cargo pod. The second is to tilt the container to discharge the contents of one side. By placing a partition inside both JMIX, the discharge method allows up to four deliveries at four different locations. Another mission for the cargo UAS is vertical replenishment. The aircraft delivers two full JMEX to an amphibious ship and recovers six empty and folded JMEX for retrograde. The cargo pod is slewed about its tail wheel while the skids close upon the JMEX. The aircraft and cargo pod are each recovered and secured to the ship by a traversal system which, by design, incorporates currently available products and techniques. The traversal system continues past the crew accommodation tower safely separating recovery operations at the afterdeck from takeoff operations on the foredeck. Traversal systems are mirrored, port and starboard, providing fail-safe redundancy and high-throughput vertical lift operations. Watertight walls enclose the forward space under the flight deck. 40-foot containers at either side hold additional cargo unmanned aircraft and spare parts. At a deep water port with a dockside crane, the flight deck is lifted for access to the flat racks, facilitating high throughput loading and unloading. Landlines of communication from the port can then be used to establish an inland distribution node from which the cargo UAS can perform forward supply operations in support of the warfighter. To round out this video, we'll show an attack variant of the aircraft, followed by small scale functional flight demonstrations of the three key features of the monotilt rotor aircraft architecture. Go forward. Alright, so you want to go in for a flight? Yeah, slowly. Wings should be locked in.
Are they down? The technical details of this design are provided in the following government technical reports and conference papers. Thank you for watching this glimpse of the future.